made your first eBay sale and now you have to pack it. So we sold this Italian cashmere sweater. So when you're selling these nice cashmere sweaters, I like to fold them up nicely. A little bit nicer than, you know, an average little everyday sale. So I'm going to kind of give it the old uh, Martha Stewart folding treatment here. Give it a little bit of a tissue paper because I think that's a nice touch when you're sewing something nice like cashmere. Try to not put lint all over it. I'm trying to cut down a bit on plastic, shipping out like a ton of plastic. And this one also sold in like four or five hours. So I had just listed it and I had not um, packaged it up at all. So I'm just going to wrap it up nicely in packing paper. nicely here with some packing paper and let's pass on a little bit of a thank you sticker. I don't have any um, thank you notes right now to put in my packages but that's a really nice touch. And then I'll just slip it into this bag. It's a 10 by 13. Come over to our scale. We'll pop her on there. She is 10 ounces. So we will send her out to Ground Advantage. Let's see what I put. Okay. So we'll put 10 ounces in our amount. We'll do, what did I say it was? 10 by 13? 10 by 13. 10 by 13. And we'll say it's a few inches deep. It doesn't really matter a whole lot. Okay, ground advantage. So that's going to be $5 to ship out. We're in Iowa and this is shipping to Scottsdale, Arizona. Hmm. Interesting. She paid $5 for shipping, $50 for the sweater. Um, and I know I paid about $10 or so. So I'm estimating a 30 roundabout profit on this sweater. So we're gonna let this print on our Dymo. Toss on the label. Ready to go? Ship it.